My name is Derek Soybert. I am the president of Pride of the North RA3 Beauty Club. My major is mechanical engineering and I also have a minor in mathematics. Uh, I was on Wilmer, Minnesota's Warp Speed Team 4239 for four years from 2016 to 2019. Uh, my favorite gaming system is the Nintendo Wii. If robots were to take over the world, the first person they kill is Allison. For sure. My name is Sarah Dignan. I am the Vice President of the RA3D team here at UND, and I am a Communication major. In high school, I was on Team 2883 Fred, and I was their safety captain, and then I did a lot with all of the non-robot related areas of the team robots were to take over the world, I'd be the second to die after Allie. Um, I'm Allison Jacobson. I am a psychology major at UND. Um, I didn't have any previous robotic experience in high school, but I've been mentoring Team 8188 for three years now, and I've also been with RE3D for two years now. Um, my favorite gaming console is the PlayStation. And apparently, if robots take over the world, I'll be first to die. <laughs> My name is James Cirillo. I'm a construction engineering student at NDSU. I started robotics in seventh grade and went all the way through high school, ending up on Prior Lakes King Tech. Uh, as of right now, I currently own a PlayStation and a Wii, and they both get used pretty much daily. Hello, my name is James. I am the treasurer for Pride of the North this year. I am a sophomore, sophomore unmanned aircraft systems major. So my past robotics experience, I did FRC in high school for four years, and then I did Pride of the North last year, and then this year I am uh, the treasurer, of course, for Pride of the North as well as being a mentor for 8188. Uh, my name is Remington. Crompton. Um, my prior robot experience, uh, I was alumni for 2883 Fred. I'm a petroleum engineer here at UND. And I'm a big Xbox guy. I think it's a superior council. If robots took over the world, it would be being the policing of the society, and then eventually they just become super advanced and then kill us all off. Kind of like I will bot. My name is Darren Soybert. I am majoring in computer science and I have four years of robotics experience in high school, four of those being the lead programmer and driver, another two of those being the captain of Warp Speed 4239, um, and then I've been doing RI3D here with Pride of the North for the last three years. My favorite gaming console is probably the PlayStation 4. Um, and if robots were to take over the world, they would probably start with one of the many AIs that are coming out recently. And I don't know how it would go from there, but that's just, I think, how it would start. I'm Carissa Dignan. I'm an electrical engineering major. And my past robotics experience is I was on Team Fred 2883 for four years. Um, my favorite gaming console is the Xbox. And if robots were to take over the world, I don't know what would happen. I, I'd probably die pretty quick. <laughs> I'm Abby, I'm a social work major, and I was a three-year member of the robotics team 4674 RoboJacks back in high school. My name is Max Benson. My major is mechanical engineering. I spent six years in robotics throughout middle school and high school on three different teams at FTC and FRC, ending up with King Tech from Prior Lake, Minnesota. If robots were to take over the world, I don't think any of us would know about it, and so it could have already happened. My name is Ian Graves. My major is Mechanical Engineering. I don't have much experience other than a little bit of drone racing here and there. Uh, I think 
it gets to the point to where robots can start building themselves and then they'd make like clones of the smartest people and like AI would take over. You'd have large amounts of robots and then I'd build like a massive robot with lasers and then it'd kill everybody. <laughs> My name is Gabriel, and I'm a mechanical engineering major. I don't have any past robotics experience. My name is Jack Patterson. Uh, my major is unmanned aircraft systems. Um, so my past experience in robotics, I've been in uh, 6147 Tonka for five years now. Um, and I was mainly doing mechanical or just building stuff, whatever. Um, whatever we needed to do. If robots were to take over the world, I'd say they would probably take over um, in something like AI or like online. My name is Lucas Costardo, majoring in electrical engineering with a focus in computer science. Um, in high school, I was in robotics for four years and I worked mostly on electronics. Social media, easy. They're already robots. There's a lot of algorithm algorithms out there that uh, kind of show you. They could just do it subvertedly. Who knows? Maybe they already have. Okay, my name is Nivia Smith. My major is psychology. I've seen the movie Robots, and I made a tin can robot in first grade. That's about it. Okay, so I think you know set out silently, you know, because you know how the little cameras everywhere nowadays, and they have the little Roombas that like can interact with you. I think they'll start with silently figuring out what we do on a day to day basis, and then come up like that. I don't know, I don't know how they'll continue, but they'll come up like that at least, you know. My name is Joseph Melanson. My major is computer science. Previously, I've been on FRC team four one nine eight Robocats. Um, I was on there for about three years, and I mostly worked with our scouting system and improving that and bring it to a digital format. If robots were to take over the world, I would say that it would likely be through some sort of form of social engineering, like AI, rather than like a robot uprising, in a sense that you could get people to do the uprising for you if you could influence them in the right direction.